Hey, what's up everybody? This is Joshua Casper. I'm here with Plugin Boutique. And today we're checking out The Big Beautiful Door by Boz Digital Labs. The Big Beautiful Door is a gate plugin that's really unique. It allows you to EQ quiet audio differently than louder audio. And there are many applications to this, including advanced side chaining and voiceover work. But what I'm going to show you today is how easy it is to remove background noise from a dialogue take. So let me show you the dialogue take we're going to be working on. Master filter, straightforward. Again, we have a high pass, band pass, low pass, cutoff frequency and resonance. Master filter. So as you can tell, there is a lot of background noise. There's the computer fan, the computer hum, there's my big deep breaths, and there's just a lot of noise that is kind of distracting. So it's actually really easy to get rid of that using the big beautiful door. Now the big beautiful door is set up into two main sections here. We have the above threshold section and the below threshold section. Now inside both of these sections we have a three band EQ. The above threshold is going to affect or EQ the audio that is above the threshold that we set with the slider. The below threshold is obviously going to EQ the quieter information or the audio that is below the threshold we set. So if I play that audio again, we're going to see the waveform ticking across the plugin. If I actually go ahead and close this down, we'll see a little bit better. But there's going to be dark blue and light blue. The dark blue is going to be the audio below the threshold, and the light blue is going to be the audio above. Let's check it out. Master filter. Here is below the threshold, here is above. Before we start EQing, what I'm going to do is try to get it to a place where the dialogue is all above the threshold while the background noise and any sort of breathing or any other noise is below the threshold. Master filter, straightforward. Again, we have a high pass, band pass, low pass, cutoff frequency and resonance. Master filter. So that's looking pretty good. Now we can start to actually do some processing. And what I'm going to do is go ahead and just turn off the above the threshold. And the reason why I'm going to do that is because it's, this is a dialogue take that I want to be as natural as possible. I'm trying to remove that noise, but I don't want to do any further EQing to my voice because then it wouldn't sound right. Drop down the EQ for below the threshold. On this third filter, I'm going to go ahead and choose low pass and then just take the frequency and pull it way over. Now remember, this is only going to affect that dark blue audio signal or everything below the threshold we set. So let's see what we have now. Master filter, straightforward. Again, we have a high pass, band pass, low pass, cutoff frequency and resonance. Master. So we've already gotten rid of all that silence in between the actual words. We can still kind of hear that breath, but we can fix that easily. The next section that's important for this type of process is the envelope section. We have the attack and release of the compressor, which is essentially what a gate is. And this is going to allow us to smooth out the dips in between when the audio has passed the threshold and when it goes below. Master filter, straightforward. Again, we have a high pass, band pass, low pass, cutoff frequency, and res. So here we have that breath. And if I want to get rid of that breath, I can actually pull the release down. And this means that the cutoff point will dip past the threshold and be quieter faster. Master filter, straightforward. Again, we have a high pass, band pass, low pass, cutoff. So there you go. Now that breath is completely gone. And all we've done is adjust the release time of the compressor or the envelope just a little bit. Now you need to be careful there. What I'm going to do real quick is just go ahead and pull these both all the way down and let's see what happens to the audio. Master filter, straightforward. Again, we have a high pass, band pass, low pass, cutoff frequency and res. So you can see these dips. You can actually hear it in the audio. It doesn't sound natural. It's actually draws attention to itself because those dips are happening so fast and you can just hear the low audio being cut out. That's really kind of the opposite of what we're looking to do. So what I'm going to do is turn these back up a little bit. And the next thing is the ratio. If the ratio is set to 1-1, one, one, we're not going to get any compression happening, any gating happening if we set it to 1-1. One, one. So that's not good. So what you want to do is kind of play with this so you're just getting enough cut out and leaving the rest alone. 
master filter. Master filter, straightforward. Again, we have a high pass, band pass, low pass, cutoff frequency and resonance. And that's it. That's how easy it is to get rid of background noise in your dialogue take using the Big Beautiful Door. Now, like I said before, there are many great and useful applications for the Big Beautiful Door, but for this tutorial, that's all I'm going to show you. I highly suggest checking out other tutorials on the advanced side chaining that you can get, and it's really for the detailed oriented, and it's next level gate plugin right here. You can check it out right now on Plugin Boutique. I'm Joshua Casper. I hope you learned something. We'll see you next time.